Hey guys, today what we're going to be doing is talking about a little bit about fire safety and turbines. Hey guys, Noons here, Airborne RC. Thanks for joining us once again. Uh, this right here is going to be going with our fire safety. So right here is I got two extinguishers. They look a little bit similar, but they're totally different. This right here, the one you see right here in front of you, this is your common one you'd see in your house, the ABC uh, extinguisher. Uh, what it goes ahead and it does is it blankets the fire in like a white powder. This one right here, it's in case you get the ground caught on fire, or a tree, a bush. Uh, unfortunately, if you crash and burn and you're burning grass, this is the one you want to go ahead and use right here. This right here is a halotron. Fire extinguisher, Halon now is considered illegal since it depletes the ozone layer. So this right here is Halotron. It's made by Buckeye. This, what it does, is it puts out a gas, common similar. You can use a CO2. Uh, this one right here, more compact, a little bit cheaper than the CO2. And what it does, it's a similar principle. What it is, it's just a gas and it suffocates the fire. So let's say you have a, a fire in your plane. Or your turbine this is the one you want to use right here it won't leave any residue in your turbine fire will go out you'll be ready to go as long as you didn't burn any wires now if you spray this one on your turbine your turbines pretty much junk at that moment you got all this powder all in it you got to send that thing in to um, a, a repair facility um, I found a few on the internet uh, to rebuild the turbine after 25 operating hours, like 300 bucks. If you get this stuff in there, they're charging 700. So yeah, you gotta make sure you have uh, the proper ones. This one right here at Home Depot cost me about 44 dollars. Uh, this one right here was a Christmas present to my wife. I know how much it cost because I sent her the link. That's 98 bucks plus shipping. It was about 104 to the door. Um, Little added safety, something you need when you do the turbine, especially when you go do the turbine waiver and go through the safety. These are things right here that they make sure that you have on hand. And you have them while you're at the plane. Not sitting in the truck or the trailer, but right there on the plane. Obviously, I'd have this one right next to me on the floor, along with this one while I'm fueling the plane, first starting it up, the whole time until I'm out taxiing. Well, guys, hope you guys liked the video.